<laughs> it's all right. It's okay. Are you gonna come here? Come, come to mommy. <gasps> Yay! Yay! Oh. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness, girl! Oh, what are you pointing at? What are you pointing at? Uh-oh! Look at you with your... You have like a little mask? Huh, baby? Her nose is getting red. <laughs> and there's snow on her eyebrows. Look! <laughs> All right, should we take her back in? Are you, coming, are you gonna come back in now? Say bye. You wanna make some snow angels? Brian. Oh, Brian, you gotta do something, boy. Yes. You gotta do it right now. Right now. You gotta do it right now. Snow angel? In your boxers. Go try. We're just running around the house you gotta with do your it. boxers you on. I can't. Yes. It's too cold. Come on. It doesn't matter. It's, it's too bright. cold. Come on. Where are you going, baby? Where are you going? Let's go on that other spot. Oh, look at this girl. Ayla. Oh my goodness. Ooh. Good Lord. Hey guys, hey guys welcome, welcome back, back to our, our channel. channel. If you're new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button and you turn your post notifications on so you're notified every time we post a new video. Um, right now we are... We're driving. Going, well, oh, we're driving. Sorry. Yeah, we're going for a drive. And we just wanted to chat with you guys. Yeah. It's snowing too right now, so the trees and everything looks pretty good. But we wanted to just talk to you guys and pretty much I'd say thank you for everyone that's been like showing us support. We're new to this YouTube thing and um, we just really appreciate like everyone that's been like watching our videos and you know make, putting comments under our videos and liking. Um, so we just wanted to say thank you to all of you guys. We appreciate it. Yeah we do. We really do. Um, and we are right now we're not posting as often as we would like um, and the reason for that is because it's just it is a little difficult because Jay and I both work um, we both have full-time jobs so we work Monday to Friday sometimes Jay even works on the weekends <laughs> most weekends um, yeah actually most weekends he's working so it's like whenever we have we are both available is when we film. Um, we are hoping to like film a lot more though and like just put out videos. Maybe at least two videos a week. Um, but we're working on that. Yeah. I mean, and for those those people that are not working, I mean, this is why we understand this is like the craziest time in the whole world where COVID is because of COVID, there's a lot of people without jobs. Yeah. You know. I know it's just been like a like a really rough over a year now. Everyone was like, "Yeah, we're so excited for 2020," and I'm like, oh, "I'm excited for a new year, but I feel like it's just gonna be like the same thing. Like we're still yeah, going until, through." Yeah. yeah. Until things settle, which I don't, I, I don't know, I don't know about you, but I don't think the, the way things are looking, even with the vaccine, it's gonna take a while before things get back to normal or whatever normal might be. I know, right? I don't think things will ever go back to like normal. So? No. Roshni just like brought it up to me like the other day before we would like drink from like each other's cups and stuff, like yeah. share our drinks and stuff, and now we. It's not yeah, like we're we yeah we're not purposely not doing it, but we've been so used to not doing it for like like close to a year that we just don't do it anymore. It's like just like little things like that, or like I before like I got pregnant, I was working in the city, um, and the subways in New York is disgusting. I always thought it was disgusting, but like. Even like now with like COVID and stuff, I'm like I can't even imagine like people 
people that have to like go to work and like use public transportation and stuff. It's just like, ugh. yeah, just, for yeah. for the other people like me, you know, <laughs> we don't have the luxury of working from home. Yeah, I work from home. Jay doesn't. Yeah. Um, I mean, guys, whatever you do, just find something to do. Like, we have full time jobs and. We still manage to do this, yeah. and it, it gets your mind off of a lot of things, especially right now. Um, yeah. you, you just need to keep yourself occupied. Uh, I think the best way to do that is like doing this. Yeah, just do something you love, like or you've always wanted to do, like yeah, something new. That thing that yeah. you wanted to do, and for some reason you couldn't, or or you just you never... didn't have time. Yeah, right? You, like yeah. you didn't have time to do it. But now you have all the time in the world. Not necessarily all the time in the world, but you have time. You know, there's a lot of a lot of people in the world that they they couldn't do things because they're too busy or they couldn't spend time with their kids or, yeah. or with their family because they're always working. Um, now you, you can do it. I'm, um, the pandemic is really difficult on like a lot of people but try to find like the silver lining or like yeah. the positives out of everything you know we'll show you this, this view oh yeah uh, it's so beautiful it's freaking amazing yeah let me show you this look how beautiful it is out here the trees literally look like they've been like dipped in like yeah. sugar powdered sugar or something there used to be a guy that I used to work for. We're still really good friends. And he always told me one thing. You'll work and work and work and work and then by the time by the time you get to a certain age, you're 50 or, or 45, you've done all of this work. You accumulated all of this money. And you didn't stop and look around, look what's around you. You've been to all of these places, but haven't really like been there you know what I'm saying you haven't really seen it yeah. like, like yeah. really like take it in like, exactly you, you just pass by yeah I know what you mean like when I first started working I thought of it like oh I have to go to work right but then you have to like change your mindset sometimes and like be excited for it if you're excited even if you don't love work, like if you change your mindset and say, oh, I'm going to work, I have a job. Like some people don't have a job. Just like be positive and like just like little things will just like hopefully change how you feel and how you look at things. And like I thought about that in like the beginning, I really didn't like work and I started looking at like little positives and it completely like changed the way I felt about working. I mean, right now it's a little difficult because I'm literally working from home and I don't get to interact with people as much as I'd like. And that's one of the things I loved, like going into the office and interacting and like, you know, just having conversations with your coworkers and stuff. Um, a lot of us don't have that now, but... I think that's the, the main reason why we're doing this, right? Like the interactions. Because, yeah. Because, I mean... Mostly for you, but I, I interact with people and a lot of my clients, but from a distance now. Everything is phone calls, FaceTime. Yeah. You know, so I got into that. We well, we both got into that habit. Mm -hmm. And we just wanted to share our experience or our life really. Yeah, I mean we can we can make like another video I think as to why we started our channel yeah but I don't uh, yeah we'll, we'll do that later down the road like why we started because I don't really want to go through that right now you know? yeah there's just there are some things that happened recently that you know really pushed us to do this um, we're not ready to like talk about that right now but 
what's to come. You have no idea what tomorrow holds. Just like follow your heart and like go for it. Don't second guess yourself. Just, just do it. Just yeah. do it. Um, there's a lot of things that I myself, actually both of us, right? We wanted to we wanted to do and because of work or I was always the type of uh, person that would be like, you know, I gotta work. If if I'm not there, then yeah. who's gonna do it? You know, let, let's just get my work done and I'll see to have a vacation. Like I, we literally went on a vacation for three days. Yeah, a weekend. One time. Yeah, one time. Our first ever vacation together, we went to Mexico for like three days. We left like Friday afternoon and we came back like Monday. Yeah. But like, even if it's like just like a short amount of time, it's still yeah, nice it's to still like to, to get reset. away. Yeah. You know, even if you don't have the opportunity to do something like that, you know. Go for a drive. Like, for we've a drive. been doing yeah. drives with Ayla. Like, we honestly don't go out much because we're just like extra careful yeah. you know with having like a, a baby um but we do drives um yeah, often I, i've been doing a lot of driving uh, it's only because it gets us out of the house it gets her out of the house too yeah. because uh since since ayla's been born she, we haven't been any anywhere no we, we've Literally. just been home yeah and that's all she knows like even if it's a nice day out, I, she's, she would be inside the house. Yeah. She, we, we wouldn't bring her out. We're not like as like, crazy as we were in the beginning. Like in the beginning, it was like like whatever comes in the house, we're sanitizing and like doing yeah. the most. Yeah. When COVID first started, yeah. it was it was crazy precaution. Yeah. Now, I mean. Loosened up a little yeah. bit, but we're still very like careful and cautious and just trying to be as safe as possible. Um, COVID for us has been difficult, but and I know there's so many people out there that has gone through such difficult times um, the past like year, year and a half. Um, so just like share that with us. We'd love to like you know hear about other people's experiences and what they've been doing. Brian is with us. He's in the back. He's with us most of the time. But from our last video, you know, you all know that he lost, right? So after the snow <laughs> finished tonight, he has something that he has to get done for one of our videos. Yeah. So you guys have to, have to, have to get the video up to how many likes? We're gonna do a hundred likes. If you guys get the video to one hundred likes, we'll um. Yeah, and share it and subscribe. <laughs> then we'll release the video of him. And if you guys don't know what we're talking about, go watch our last video. Yeah, what it's is our last video? In there. Um, we did the Who Knows Me Better challenge, and it was between uh, Jay and Brian. Yeah. This is so crazy. The sun is literally like right there. It's been a while since we got a lot of snow like this, right? Yeah. Last, like for the past like few years um the winters we've if we get like one big snowstorm the entire winter that's like that's we're it. lucky yeah. yeah you're lucky um but this year this is like our third yeah third yeah i think third like snowstorm say hi say hi our 
right guys, we just got home and now it's time to prepare dinner for the baby, right? We're gonna have dinner now? Yay! Um, Jay's actually outside shuffling snow. So we're just gonna close out the video right here. Right, baby? Tell them, say like, comment, share, and subscribe. And make sure you subscribe. <laughs> See, like, comment, share, and subscribe. Okay. And we'll see you in our next video. <laughs> Bye. Close it out. You guys have to close it out. Like this. Oh.